Hey everybody, welcome back. So I'm not trying to be cute or anything. I'm actually about to reveal something. I just want to shock you guys right out of the gate. And that is, I am uh, obviously sort of clean shaven at the moment. Uh, I don't know how many of you have actually seen this before. Uh, usually a couple times a year, I will sort of shave uh, my goatee off and then just let it grow back. It grows back really fast. I mean, pretty much within like a week and a half, you'd probably never even know I shaved it off. So yep, this is uh, my face. So once again, uh, we're back with another pickups video. At this point, I'm not even gonna say it's gonna be a couple weeks because at this point, obviously, I seem to be making them now uh, several times a week. So here we are for yet another one. So first up, you may remember I got a Top Gun in a previous video and today I have Days of Thunder in 4K. Got this off Amazon, it was actually dropped to 20 bucks and then there was like a coupon for it. So it was like 15 bucks and I was like, that's pretty cool. Actually, I hadn't watched this in a really long time. Watched it the other night and I actually forgot how entertaining it is. Another 4K one I got uh, because I it was basically the only Star Wars one I didn't have and that was Rogue One. This one was not in the Skywalker Saga box set and also the only one I didn't have in 4K. So now I have changed that. I actually got Rogue One at Best Buy. Uh, luckily the Best Buy I go to is now open. So I was able to actually go inside uh, which feels like it has been forever and a day. So I got Rogue One and I also got this small case for uh, that new camera that I got and the camera does fit very snug inside. Well, also while I was at Best Buy, I did get, uh, this is on sale. I don't know if any of you guys are interested. They had an Anchor portable charger. You can tell hopefully just how small it is. Is hopefully you can see that there. It has a USB uh, connection and also a USB-C connection. And I think this is normally like 60 bucks or something. And it was on sale for 30 at Best Buy. It might still be on sale if you guys are looking for something like this. Because the thing is with that new camera, I can actually power it off of a USB connection, which means I can actually attach it to a portable charger like this. So I really wanted to kind of get one that was still small, but still kind of strong enough to do that if I need it. Plus the power does go off uh, every so often here. So it's nice to have a couple portable chargers as well. Another thing I got in is the new steel book of Friday the 13th, the original Friday the 13th. And what I love about this steel book is of course it uses the original poster artwork. There's the back with that great line on it. There's the side with the title. Now the only thing I don't like unfortunately is the fact that the disc on the inside is literally just a blue disc. Now, obviously this is the same release that has been out for many, many years. So waiting on the announcement of the new box set coming. But until then, I basically wanted this because again, I'm a sucker for anything Friday 13th. I love that it has the original poster artwork on the outer box. The only thing is I kind of wish the disc, wish they did something with it, made a picture disc or something just to make it look different and not the exact same, just blue disc that has been out there for you know all these years and then finally something uh very very cool that came out from quartet records and that is uh a new release of the original soundtrack to john carpenter's the thing now i have a very old cd release of it i think it was actually like i'd have to double check but like an early i think rca records one like it's it goes back, I think, sometime in the 90s or something. So this is the soundtrack release uh, that has been completely remastered from uh, the original tapes. And it sounds really good. I actually did a back-to-back -back, uh, comparison real quick. And uh, at least compared to the old copy of the music that I have, uh, this sounded really, really good. So that's it for the pickups for this video. Just a couple quick things, but still, you know. <laughs> they still seem to be a little bit never ending. And I did also want to mention something uh, just real quick that I'm trying to stay on top of. And I'm noticing that my notifications for comments um, are not really listing that many. It's basically showing me only a couple of them. And then once I actually go and check my comments, there'll be a whole slew of them there that I didn't even know were there. And some of them sometimes have been there for like a couple days. I'm trying to stay on top of that. I'm trying to make sure I, I constantly check uh, comments and everything and not just go off the notification tab. But just want to give you guys a heads up in case you're wondering why I'm replying to something that you commented on like days ago. It might be literally because I l just saw it at that moment. And I'm getting ready to do the next Q&A video. I already got uh, some great questions that you guys have that I will include in that one. But if you guys have any more questions that you want me to include in the video, uh, definitely let me know. And also let me know if you want your 
uh, name mentioned or not. And there are a couple more videos coming as well, uh, including the next one in the poster series. I know I got a little bit behind. I actually already have it recorded. Just got to go through and finish editing it, and that should be up very, very soon. So that's it for this video. So I got to cut a little bit of everything, it seems. So again, definitely let me know if you have any uh, Q&A questions that you want included in the next video. And as always, thank you for watching, and I will see you on the next one.